I don't know, I thought I got most of it off, but it smells more like a fox than a dog to me. Oh, hello, Len Sunset here, ex-children's entertainer. Uh, nice to see you. Do excuse my attire, I'm not long up. So, uh, yeah, apologies for that. Anyhow, keeping it topical, um, I've been watching Pebble Mill and I've just heard that Donald Trump, the President of the United States, has got himself the coronavirus. A dose of cold, it's 19. Who'd have thought that? Not only that, but his wife, Mulan, has also got it. Unbelievable. Nobody's safe. Nobody's safe. So it got me thinking, you know, I, I also come from a long line of, you know, not so well people, ailments running my family. Um, my uncle Pete, he was a sweater. <sighs> not a lot you could do about it, apart from probably stand away from him. In fact, his school, he was known as wet wipe, you know, so... He's always had a problem, um, you know, bucket, the ready at barbecues, that's all you can really do. Um, Jane, cousin Jane, lovely woman, massive hands, massive hands. She could carry eight oranges at one time. Not much use, but, you know, a good party trick. Um, but, you know, she had a, a rash in the shape of Africa, which, again, was a novelty, but a, a source of embarrassment to her at times. So, so, anyhow, I'm just saying, you know, no one is immune, you know. I mean, the President of the United States getting coronavirus, I mean, there's a turn up for the books, isn't there? You know, who'd have thunk it? Anyhow, all I'm saying is your health is something not to be taken lightly. And I wish you all the best of health. Look after yourselves and one another.